Hey there, I'm Darren Kitchen, founder of Hack5, and I just wanted to take a moment to say thank you all for your support over the years. I never would have imagined 17 years ago to last week starting this journey that is Hack5, how remarkable and rewarding it would be, and it wouldn't be without you. And I also can't believe it's been since, what, 2009 that a box of rubber duckies was being dumped on my head that we were no clue what kind of impact we would have on cybersecurity, inventing keystroke injection and releasing that to the world. And I hope with that and with this, you are now as excited as we are for the new USB rubber ducky. This is a passion project that we have been working on for over two years now. The pandemic kind of threw a monkey wrench in our manufacturing, but in that time, we got to spend a lot of time working on the software side of things. And with that, I mean, I don't want to say it was over-engineered, but as a project, it is an order of magnitude more what we're delivering today than the original cocktail napkin requirements documents. I mean, with the new USB rubber ducky alone, we're launching two hot plug zero days, right? An entirely new way to fingerprint operating systems. You know, I've always wanted to know, like, is this a Windows machine, a Mac, a Linux machine? And we can do that on the desktop, you know, passively or minimally, and then on mobile, figuring out what that is as well. I mean, and then based on that, run different payload snippets from within your payload based on the different components, like the results. And then finally, a, a new side channel exfiltration attack. Uh, an entirely new pathway for getting data out of a computer and one that doesn't rely on the kinds of things that endpoint device security has focused on, networks and mass storage. Uh, it is something that we are so passionate about. We're dubbing it keystroke reflection. I want you to dig into the white paper because it's fascinating, but the TLDR is that basically we are exploiting the bi-directional architecture of the PC keyboard that goes back to the early 80s. I mean, look at this, this computer, Keyboard doesn't even have one of the little LED things for numlock caps lock and all of that. And then the architectural changes would become de facto standards that would become part of the like USB HID implementation. So the attack surface on this thing is almost 40 years of PCs. So I'm very excited about that. And what's more exciting is that all of these are wrapped into extensions that can be included in your Ducky script so that you can use these like building blocks to make your own creative payloads and if you have been writing payloads in Notepad and Nano for a while, I cannot begin to tell you how much you are going to love Payload Studio. All of the Hack5 devices, not just the USB rubber ducky, but you know, your, your Bash Bunnies, your Key Crocs, all of the Hack5 critters have got a, finally a proper integrated development environment with the syntax highlighting and auto-completing and extension syncing and debugging, all of those amazing features. I, I can't even begin to explain what a game changer this is. So if uh, if you have, you just go, go and check out Community Edition. It's completely free. There's even some more cool features in Pro, but it is honestly the best way to write Ducky Script, which, not to bury the lead, but Ducky Script itself, just wow. Talk about, like, to, speaking of de facto standards, that's one that became the standard for hot plug attacks. It, it's crazy to just think how powerful two simple commands, you know, string or inject some keys, and delay, like wait for a moment, have been, and how those have been like the de facto standards in the keystroke injection that we invented. And now with Ducky Script 3.0, it's an entirely complete structured programming language with loops and logic and functions and interactivity with the target and randomization. I mean, I've written payloads that solve Wordle, that play Doom, uh, ones that are games where you interact with the payload like Cave. It is extremely easy to learn and extremely powerful. I, I love that it builds on the concepts of the original USB rubber ducky and, and ducky script being so simple. And what's nice is that the more you learn, the more you uncover creative possibilities. So it's not like this monolithic thing that you have to learn all at once. It's like, you can just take it chapter by chapter and with, with each new chunk, you add to the ability. I mean, I, I don't know what speaks more to it. Uh, obviously you're gonna find all of it at, at docs.hack5.org. There's a free ebook, but you know, like speaking of the language itself and how much it's evolved, this is the old USB rubber ducky book. But if you want something more than just the fundamentals as I like drop it on the floor, uh, something uh, more complete with practical examples and exercises and projects, it's an entire course book, right? So I think that speaks volumes to how much this has come. 
Uh, or, you know, if, if this isn't your bag and you're more of a, a visual learner, I teach an entire course on this subject. So I invite you to join me in the virtual classroom because it is going to be a great time. Uh, and, and I say that recognizing that I get to be the one that stands here and introduces you to all of this, knowing that the team has been hard at work on this. And it is just such an honor to represent them and to like see this community flourish because what we've created. And I know, like looking at Payload Hub over the last few months and all of the creativity that has come out with just the simple Ducky script and knowing like what's possible now, it's just incredible. And I am so honored to have created something and to be part of a team that is creating something like huge like this and that it is empowering you guys and your creativity. Um, so just quite simply, thank you for the support for 17 years. And with that, I, I know I could geek out about every little aspect of this, but I, I do wanna keep the video short, but there's so much to dig into. So usbrubberducky.com, that's gonna take you directly to the spot over at hack5.org where you can learn more about the course and the book and USB Rubber Ducky and Payload Studio and all of the accoutrements that come with it. I don't even know if I mentioned the fact that there's a pocket guide. I mean, anyway, so with that, I'm Darren Kitchen. Thank you for your support. Trust your technology.